Oh, hey, good morning. This is kind of a, a beginning level rock and roll uh, way back in the day, probably 1958, 59, somewhere along in there, I don't know. Link Ray, and the song is Rumble. It's in the key of E. Now, I'm using my little G deck. That's the only thing I got going here. The effect is uh, the drum is grunge, I believe it's called, 120 beats a minute. And I got tremolo set for my, my effect on the guitar. That's the Link Ray sound. And I'll play it a couple times and then I'll show you how to do it. It's real easy. Watch me mess it up. That's all there is to that song, and it, it made him famous and made him a lot of money, so who knows. But anyway, it's an E, a tremolo E, and then a D, a plain old D, only you don't hit the first string. We're just hitting the, the, the middle four strings. We're skipping the high and the low E's here. getting this one finger bar A, same four strings, skipping high and low E, D again, and then one more time with the D, and then the B, and then this little run, we're starting here on the third fret. So we're up here on the third fret, first three strings, open, but on the G string now we're going to just slide back. Then up here on the high E, on the twelfth fret, I'm just using the second and third strings. I'm leaving the first string open because he played with a flat pick and he did the type of pick and I, I never did know how to do that, never did learn that, I guess, back in the day. And I've been a finger picker, a thumb picker all my life. So let me show you. With a thumb pick, it's just... But if I leave this first string open and work it in, it sounds more like what he did. Then he went, but I'm gonna go back to I'm gonna go back and do an A. And then he went. And then he went. But he had the bass going. I don't have a bass going here, so it'd be. giving you this. Mm -hmm. 
That's Mr. Lake Ray's Rumble. I think he's still around. So good luck with this one.